Hi everybody, how are you? Today I am here to bring you Chapel from Mr. Daniel. So I'm gonna go ahead and just share the video that he wanted to show all of you today. So I'm gonna go over to here on my computer. I know it takes a second. My computer's being super duper extra, extra slow today. So I think you can see it now. Let's go ahead and learn a little bit about Easter. The story of Easter. Jesus' sacrifice. I'm done. This is Jesus. Hey, oh! Hey, Jesus. Who is the Son of God and the Savior of the world. While Jesus was on earth, he taught everyone about God's love and healed people from their sickness. He did many miracles like calming storms and even raised people from the dead. The Jewish leaders and teachers did not like what Jesus... We're going to skip some of this because we saw this story with Mr. Daniel last week. And we're going to come back to here. But very early on Sunday morning, the woman who cared for Jesus went to go visit his body and found that his tomb was empty and that he was no longer there. Don't be afraid, said an angel. He is not here. He is risen. At this, the woman remembered that Jesus had told them that he would rise again on the third day and ran to go tell the disciples what they had seen and heard. Huh? Hey ah! And then for the next 40 days, Jesus appeared to his disciples and many others and showed them that he was alive and well. <laughs> He taught them that what he did was the only way that they could be forgiven and be with God forever. For God so loved the world that he gave his one and only son so that everyone who believes in him will not perish but have eternal life. That is the story of Easter. And now... I have a little message for you from Mr. Daniel. Let's see what he wants to say. There we go. Hi, friends. Hi, Mr. Daniel. Happy Easter. I miss you all so much. In the video, did you see how they went looking for Jesus and they couldn't find him? And they were sad because it was like, oh no, Jesus is gone. And then all of a sudden, what happened? Jesus shows up and he's like, hi. And they got so excited and so happy. You know, even if we can't see things with our eyes, it doesn't mean that they're not there. Like for example, what if I told you Mr. Daniel has an Easter egg right by his heart? Can you see it? Can you see my Easter egg? You can't see it? Oh, wait. Let's see. Ah, it was there all along. You couldn't see it, but it was there. And just like that, even if we can't see Jesus, he's always with us. You know where? Right here in our hearts. Let's pray. Put your hands together. We say, thank you, God. Thank you, God. For loving me. For loving me. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. For my family. For my family. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. For always being in my heart. For always being in my heart. Amen. Amen. Let's sing our song together. Ready? Go now in peace. Go now in peace. May the love of God surround you. Everywhere, everywhere you may go. We did it. And friends, even though we can't see each other face to face, I'm always with you. I love you so much. I'll be praying for you. Bye, friends. See you next week.
Oh, Bye, me. Mr. Daniel. Thank you so much for bringing us the message about Jesus and Easter, Mr. Daniel. All right, boys and girls, that is our chapel for this week. Happy Easter. I want you to go around and tell everybody you see Christ is risen. Happy Easter. No.